大家好, I'm Nathan Rich, aka Huoguodawang. Today's a quick video update on the status of my channel on YouTube. As a lot of you know by now, my subscriber count on YouTube keeps mysteriously going down day after day. As soon as it goes up past a thousand, the minimum to get support, it magically goes down to around 500. And since you have to maintain that minimum for at least one month before you can even talk to support, it looks like they don't really want to talk to me very much. And of course, when I look at my other statistics, I have 1.2 million views and literally thousands of comments from people about their subscriber status not being counted. So what's new, you ask? I found something very interesting hidden in the back end that further proves the situation. Somebody posted a comment with a link to this page, a lady who actually works at YouTube. I intruded into her thread and asked about my problem. She told me about a classic version of the YouTube backend and said maybe it would help clarify. Keep in mind when you listen to her recommendation to me that I already told her that I can't join the partner program because they keep removing my subs. Here's her suggestion to me. If you lost those subscribers, they aren't actually your subscribers anymore. If your channel is in the YouTube Partner Program, I recommend contacting creator support with your questions as they might be able to provide more insight. I actually got through to a person at YouTube, but she was no help. Back to square one. But what she revealed to me is actually more damning evidence. You see, I didn't realize that the classic back end showed different information than the new front end. So let's take a look at what information the classic one revealed. Remember that video that I released showing a certain YouTuber making racist statements about Chinese people? Did you notice the dislikes are way more than the likes? I mean, the likes are only 1.1K while the dislikes are 1.6K. My God, it looks like everyone hated this video and they actually liked the other guy, right? Wrong. Let's look at the real numbers. Oh, it looks like this video actually has almost 16,000 likes. Not the measly 1.1K YouTube is telling you it has. Whoops. Okay, that's all good and fine, but what about subscribers? So this is the normal backend graph for subscribers. Pretty much no one is subscribing to me, it looks like. But let's take a look at the classic backend. Here we can see it says, at the time of filming this, 242 subscribers, even though the public number is 449. Now this goes up and down, but as you know, mysteriously always goes back to under a thousand. But look at this, the real subscriber count, over 96,000 subscribers. Look at that graph. That's people joining my channel. So why does it only say 242? Well, let's take a look at the next tab, subscribers lost. Do not adjust your eyes and no, this is not a mistake or the same graph as before. This is the subscribers lost graph. Look familiar? Interesting, I lost over 96,000 subscribers in the exact pattern that I gained them. So now we see what's happening very clearly. YouTube made a big mistake by leaving this old classic backend running because as they're destroying my subscriber count, I can actually see them doing it. Every time you subscribe, they simply remove you as a subscriber. And let's take a look at all the wonderful YouTube money that I've been making over the months. Yeah, nothing. Do you see now how they do this? And if you're wondering if YouTube thinks you are a human or not, I'm posting my entire subscriber list. If you subscribe to me and you're not on this list, YouTube is treating you like a robot. Your voice doesn't count to them. Add a comment to tell the world that you're not a robot. And if there's anyone out there who thinks that's not what's happening, shame on you for being such a cynic. In other news, a friend of mine is using his channel to ask about my channel. YouTube told them they will get back to him. I'll definitely be holding my breath to wait on that reply. In the meantime, I thank everyone for the continued pressure on YouTube. I think eventually they'll have to do what's right if we keep bothering them. Until then, I'll keep you posted if there's any new developments. Thank you for your continued support, everyone. And remember, even without validation from YouTube, I will continue to make videos, so don't worry about it. They aren't stopping anything. See you, everyone.